back for another year. Um, just a matter of days away before another Arnold Palmer Invitational. How excited are you for this event again? Well, we get a little more excited each year. Uh, it gets better and better. The field gets better and the players are better players. So this year should be top of the list. The field is another great field. Committed already, Bubba Watson, Adam Scott winning already this year, uh, Rory McIlroy, Jason Day. That's a spectacular field, isn't it? It is. That's, that's a field in itself. But all the players are good, and any one of them could be outstanding this year. What do you think of Jason Day as a uh, player now? I mean, a kid in his, I call him a kid, but um, how good he has become and, and how the game has developed with him and around him? Well, he, he's an outstanding player, and he's an outstanding young man. So he'll be a good good entry. Definitely a great entry, right? Yes. Um, as for the golf course, um, we've talked in years past. You've done changes here, but last fall you finished up the new greens. What do you like of what they've done to the greens here for your tournament? Well, the golf course overall is as probably the best it's ever been. Uh, the, the field, the grass is very uniform throughout. Uh, the roughs are good, the fairways are good, and you know, it's, it's really a difficult job to get a golf course uh, in overall excellent condition, and this year we've come pretty close to doing just that. What excites you the most about the tournament week? I mean, you've been part of this tournament for decades now, tournament host. Do you still get the butterflies even to this day? Well, absolutely. We, we get, we're scared, we, things won't go right, but generally we're as good as we've ever been in the history of the tournament. Uh, we've got a great field, a young field, a, a excellent field of players, and uh, it's going to be fun. It's going to be a real fun event. And how about when the fans come out, the golf fans, you get the non-golf fans, um, and what your, your presentation that you put together every year is phenomenal. And it is about the fans coming out, isn't it? No question. Uh, the fans make the tournament. They're, the, they're what really counts. How's your health? I mean, I see you every year, you're doing well. You look great. I mean, look at you, you, got, you, you look fantastic. Well, I tell you, this is the first year uh, that I can ever think that uh, I haven't played golf. I'm, uh, I didn't play the last couple of years, but my, I fell last year twice, and that kind of set me back. So I'm waiting down to get ready to get playing again, and maybe someday I'll play in the tournament again. You, you never know. Uh, you still come to work, obviously, every day. How much do you enjoy coming to work every day here? Well, I enjoy watching these young people come along. Uh, you think of all the players that are playing in this tournament from all over the world, and, and our local guys, uh, members here, that are playing in the tournament. So we've got, we've got a field that is untouchable and uh, it gets only better as time goes on. Uh, and this year is no exception. We'll, we'll have uh, our local guys, club members, we'll have tour players that are on the tour, and, and this is gonna be an excellent year for golf. As for this golf tournament, what, what this golf tournament not only means to the Bay Hill Club and Lodge, but the hospital. We talk about the hospitals every year, and this, and really when it's all said and done, the, the amount of charity and, and the money that goes towards the hospitals is such important to you, isn't it? We can't do enough for the hospital, and, and of course what the people have done for the uh, charity. 
is unbelievable. If, if every individual knew what it means to have them here for this tournament and what it means to kids uh, in this area, it, it would go on and on and on forever. Uh, simply because we're providing more care, uh, more expertise, medicine-wise, uh, and that's fun. You, you see these kids uh, that are being treated, and whether it be a kidney problem or whether it be a, 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 a personal problem, we take care of it. And, and the doctors are so good. I talk to them every day and watch what they're doing and see what they're doing for these kids. It's exciting. It's very, very exciting. Got to ask you about Sam, your grandson. How's he doing? And He's going to be in the field and um, doing okay. He's hanging in there in a couple of years now as a full-time member on the PGA Tour. Well, I, I, I avoid talking too much about Sam because people think I'm favoring him, and uh, it's not a question of favoring him. He's working hard. But he is your grandson, so I, why would anyone question that? Well, <laughs> he's working very hard, and, and of course, uh, a week ago he had a good tournament, and that jacked him up in the standings. He, he can feed the kids now, and that's good, and, and he's excited, too. I know how excited he is. And I know I was there once in that same position and watching him win money and, and get ready to play a, a lifetime of golf is so exciting for me to see him doing that. And I hope everyone comes out and watches him play. I know it's pretty neat though, uh, you being his grandfather and obviously he's the grandson and he's in a career that you were part of. I mean, that's that's a very unique situation, isn't it? I started the same way, just like he is. I went out and started playing golf, and uh, I was fortunate. I won some tournaments and got into some money and, uh, through winning, and he's doing the same thing, and it's tough, I'll tell you. You get a couple of weeks where you don't win any, and you start thinking, Jesus, you know, this could go on a long time. But he's picked it up. He's, he's won enough that, that he's going to be good, and he'll be a factor in the tour. Who do you, can you give me a winner? I always ask you this every year. You got a winner for the tournament. But I don't think I would. I, if I knew who was going to win, I wouldn't tell you. Oh, okay. I, I, I like Jason Day, Adam Scott. I mean, playing some pretty good. I mean, you saw them. Adam Scott and what he did and what he's doing, uh, these, these guys are, they're good and they're coming on. The PGA Tour, what do they say? These guys are good, aren't they? And they are, are good and they will be a factor come next week. Let me ask you before we let you go, um, Masters is coming up. Uh, how much do you enjoy going back and, and being part of the festivities of Augusta? Well, I think of the excitement of the Masters and when I first went there and when I go now, and the excitement hasn't died at all. It's as exciting as it ever has been. And seeing people who haven't had the opportunity that I've had to be there and seeing the excitement in the people's face uh, that are watching and are playing is real fun. What is it like being the honorary starter? Well, I enjoy that and uh, whether I'll do that how uh, many times, if ever, uh, has been fun. And I remember watching Gene Sayers and yeah. the guys way back doing it. And I'll watch as long as I live.